he's he's the man. So well, the, the minute I heard it, I, I kind of smelled a rat. So, you know, that's, that's the way it is these days. Well, we'll have to wait and see what, what comes of it. I've never been a believer, regardless of uh, the president or regardless of what party holds the White House or, or holds Congress, I have never been a believer that... Uh, of not talking to people. Yeah. yeah, we will. Take care. Okay. All right. And let's go to uh, Daryl. How you doing, Daryl? I'm doing great. And Fran, speaking on behalf of the Rat Coalition, I take <laughs> great offense at what you just said. I'm tired of people talking about smell like a rat. Now, let me get to you, Mr. Root, your <laughs> opening comment. If you're willing to sleep with Donald Trump, well, I will be willing to go down uh, the alligator alley and buy that aluminum <laughs> sliding on that uh, flat we're out there. We got to help our fellow Americans to help our fellow And we got a little joke, Daryl, that we all have a price to leave out of negotiation. So now let me, let me, let me. I thought I heard a laughter in the background when you said that. Now I don't know if that was Rob or I, or was that the phone screen who bust out? That is, that was Frank. Was that great? Thanks, I think, but enough. The words of that former great uh, Republican state person, the one that was just a couple of days ago, um, Nancy Reagan, when she just said, Stan will just say, no, yeah. don't switch. <laughs> Levi again. Uh, okay. 
No, no, I don't want to hold. I'm not going to hold. Um, you know, I just, I figure, I guess the solution is to, uh, to protest. And, uh, you know, I can hold the line up. I can hold you. Anything that works. It's, it's not really frustration. I think it's like a defense. I'm defending my, my God. Um, people like, you know, the people that run this institution are corrupt. And they need to be put in jail. And the people that are associated with these people, um, you know, should become educated about what it is they're supporting. And I know that some women have had abortions. Um, some of them have not been treated correctly, so they're, they, you know, uh, embraced other women for that security. And I know that this is used, you know, is a is a ploy to lure people into this this herd. And my my uh, my way of dealing with it is is protest. I feel good about it. Um, I think that, that many people don't have heart, that they're trying to look to for belonging, to become part of a group. And I'd like for people to come educated on this. I would love it if WMF starts the heat wave again, or something that brings a crowd out. Um, because I, I just believe that people are hiding. You know, guys like Dan Ruth, they're, they're working for on behalf of something or somebody. And uh, <clears throat> they hide behind, you know, mockery, um, joking, taking serious issues that other people feel, you know, to heart and, 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 and making loose of them. Which I, I just, you know, there's a lot of people that have had to, to, to die. And I'm sure if those people were here today, they would be ready to fight. And I think that people have the uh, obligation to fight on behalf of the people that are no longer here. So when it all goes, comes down to it, just remember, it's in defense.